Okay, today is the day I go home. The bathroom is finished. You want to see? All right, let's go look. Apologize for the camera. It's oh, kind of a doesn't really get a big picture, so I got to look show you little bits at a time. Uh, tile work is uh, very nice. Turned out good. Used the shower uh, last night, and oh my god, it was wonderful. Absolutely wonderful. <sighs> So that's the entry to the shower area. That's the uh, ceiling fan, the vent fan. It was a difficult process to put in. Everything was difficult. It looks easy now though. <clears throat> a pivoting, uh, a color pivoting shower door. You notice the tile goes right up to the ceiling. So there's no blockage, no way steam is going to get trapped up there. <clears throat> Two switches. The light switch, I've seen this trick before, yeah, yeah. Vent fan, which is very quiet. Spent extra money to get a quiet vent fan. <clears throat> the uh, light comes on in the shower, all the lights come on in the bathroom with the switch, um, and the vent fan is on its own switch. A little niche in the back wall, which is uh, pretty handy. It's a good size, good size niche there. <clears throat> the door is just uh, like I say, it's a pivot door. So. It's not been really clean yet, but um, it's a it's a nice door. <clears throat> Isn't exactly the tile that she wanted to have on the floor, but uh, <clears throat> it's a good it's a good tile shower tile floor. A single handle um, shower valve there. The wood green tile does look nice. It's kind of a fancy shower head on there. Uh, I gotta tell you, I enjoyed the heck out of using it. <clears throat> the shower area is, is awesome. I mean, it, it's just awesome. What can I say? It, it, it doesn't get much nicer. <clears throat> Turned out really well. Door. She wanted to have the door painted white. <clears throat> so the uh, bathroom door is white. You can see that little kickback I put in there to make a little extra space for the entry because it is a little bit narrow, but uh, that extra that extra little bit makes a big difference there. It really does. It's kind of interesting, uh, the faucet, I've never seen a bathroom faucet that swivels, it's kind of, it swivels kind of like a kitchen faucet. <laughs> I'm leaving it off to the side so she figures that out herself. The uh, sink valve, it doesn't have a regular stopper, this one you push down as a stopper and it just opens up by pushing on it again. <clears throat> I 
I don't miss the old glass block window at all. In fact, I think the window is one of my favorite things in the room. Well, I thought it was until I took that shower last night. Oh my God, that was nice. Oh, I, I can't even tell you. It'd be worth it to drive out here just to use your shower. because the previous owners, was, the wires were just too short. Um, this little area here alongside the toilet, uh, she's going to keep an eye out for like an antique cabinet of sorts to put in over here, um, you know, for towel storage and miscellaneous storage. The toilet is a like 1955 uh, four bolt four bolt toilet. I think it's about a three and a half gallon flush on the on the toilet. I like it. Uh, we decided to keep the keep the toilet because it's it's pretty nice. done. I can't take it back. <laughs> so there you have it. Thanks for watching.